Quand vous aurez le micro, soyez assez gentil de vous lever, de vous présenter, de poser votre question, puis de rendre le micro. When you have, when time comes for you to ask your question, please stand up, introduce yourselves, ask the question, and then sit down and give the mic back. Of Mr. Alejandro Aminabar. And I guess the first well, two questions I'm going to throw to you guys, and then you folks will take over. Uh, from Something that uh, Alejandro and I talked about uh, a lot from the very beginning was that we <laughs> both felt very strongly that the acting star shouldn't be in. Is it the real word, canastos? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, anyway, we had a kind of code. Yeah, it, 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 we didn't want it to be canastos, which means, you know, uh, we didn't want it to people be behaving like I am in a toga oh, and I am performing yeah. in a declamatory way. We wanted it to be, they're just human beings. They just happen to be living in the fourth century. So we wanted them to be of flesh and blood and just very, just very, very naturalistic. So, yeah, that was a... Uh, I mean, I think you always want uh, performances to be naturalistic and believable. So, yeah, it's just set in the fourth century. Uh, question. The producer. Is uh, okay, once a better time. Okay. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> sorry, what do I think about this historical character? Yeah. Uh, in a way, yeah. What? Yeah, in an, one idea that. One idea about her. Um, gosh, I mean, I, you know, I never heard of her before uh, I read the script. Um, and I think it's a... It's a pretty, it's a pretty unusual story uh, uh, to that you know that there was this woman who uh, devoted her life to her work in, in the fourth century, and then you know was a, a martyr for her beliefs. Uh, it is pr it's pretty extraordinary. I can't quite believe that no one's uh, no one's done it before. That Alejandra was the first one to 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 dig up her story and tell it. So um, I think we've kind of dug up something pretty interesting. Well, actually, the documentation is... But your husband, too, so... <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, he directs my, my every move. <laughs> uh, advice. I mean, he's a huge... As a fellow filmmaker, Alejandro is, is uh, one of his very favorite filmmakers in the world. Um, I, I think rather like your dad. I mean, just a real obsession with Alejandro. So he was just incredibly excited that this was going to happen and that um, uh, he has, he's going to see it tonight, actually. He hasn't seen it yet, so he's really, really excited to see it. But um, no, he doesn't, he, doesn't, um, he doesn't tell me how to act if he's not actually the director on the film. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Matt? 